Well, there's always a new product or ingredient that claims to be the next fountain of youth or health breakthrough, and we're always wondering if it's just hype or is it the real deal? Now, today we are uncovering collagen, which is a vital protein, which is said to be essential to supporting health and may keep us looking young. And joining us to break it all down is fitness and nutrition expert Jody Treeweiler. Hi, hey, Jody. Hey. Hi. Okay, everybody at home is wondering what is collagen <laughs> and why is it important to the human body and what, what? does it do? Raise your hand if you've taken a collagen supplement. Okay, most of us, most someone you know, collagen is the most abundant protein in your whole body. It's found in lots of tissues. 90% of your skin is made of collagen. Think of it like a scaffolding. Mm -hmm. It holds the skin up. Your muscles have collagen, your bones, your cartilage, your tendons, your ligaments. So Everything. we do, and even in the GI, we have some collagen. But for today, let's focus more on the skin and the joints. Let's do it. Yes. Yeah, collagen kind of declines as we age too, doesn't it? It does. So by the time you're 60, you have only 50% of wow, what you had in your 20s. All right. 50%. So that's a lot less. So now you want to cover two types of collagen. Yes. Endogenous and exogenous? Yes. What's so the difference between the two? Endogenous means in the body. Endogenous. Yes. So that's co collagen that your body is producing on its own. Okay. And then exogenous would be collagen that you're taking as a supplement for. So that's what mean you take. Right. Endogenous. Uh, that's Exo exogenous. Yes. yes. We do exogenous <laughs> collagen. That's what we do. We do it. We're yes. doing collagen. That's like, right. Okay. You're making it sound bad. Talk I know. Me. Sorry. It's not a bad thing. It's not a bad thing. All right. So the collagen in our body does decline, but there are things that we can do to increase the amount of collagen we're producing naturally. Okay. Good. Okay? I was going to ask you yes. if it's possible to increase Jason. our bodily exogenous <laughs> collagen ish. No. Endogenous. Oh endogenous. Potato, yes. potato. Right here. I have put a list. Oh of minerals, vitamins, and amino acids that you can eat more of to increase your collagen. Number one, if you don't have vitamin C, your body can't make collagen you at all. I take vitamin C okay. too, Jody. Well, high five. She's yes. loving it. Yes. This is why your skin is gorgeous. Girl, we're just so we know the foods so that have vitamin C. Off. Now let's talk about a mineral, copper. What? Mm. Do not go sucking on pennies, y'all. Copper is really plentiful in mushrooms and cashews. So okay. just make sure you're eating those foods. Then we've got zinc. Mm -hmm. found in oysters. Jason, you love oysters. Mm -hmm. And pumpkin seeds, okay. really high in zinc. Right. And then an amino acid called glycine. This is kind of like the fountain of youth miracle. And again, mm. without all these things, your body can't make collagen. Okay. Then I put one thing at the bottom of the list that it's aloe vera. Aloe vera. Aloe Who vera knows? juice. Yes, mm -hmm. aloe vera juice. There have been studies to show a decrease in the wrinkle depth on our faces from drinking aloe vera. And people don't realize this. I have brought some distilled aloe vera and I poured you each a little Thank bit. You. It's just straight up aloe vera juice and I want you to taste Yay. it. Cheers. <laughs> yes. Can't <laughs> I wait till I'm 60 no, to drink No, drink it. What? Okay, I'm gonna drink it right yeah. now. So this can also heal your gut if you have GI problems. Yeah, we've talked about this. Yes, this, yes. That's a Jody Tati yep. thing. That tastes good. It's, it's, it's frightening. It's like nothing. It it's like absolutely nothing. And this fine. is George's brand. I highly recommend this if you're gonna try aloe drinking that. But then what if you don't do all this mm -hmm. or you're not good about it and you want to do a collagen supplement? Right? Talk to us, which is better, powder, liquid, how much do we need to yes. take? Yes, so it's decidedly powder is the better option okay. because liquid needs a little more processing, but 10 grams has been studied, no higher. Um, these both have about 13 grams. Okay. So if you're going to take collagen, don't be taking multiple scoops a day. Too much can be negative. The FDA does not regulate supplements like collagen. Right. And we don't know if, if too much is going to harm us. Mm -hmm. So you could overdo this. So this works because we're just about out of time. I yes. want to make sure, Jody, where can people get more of your fitness and nutrition advice? Yes, so uh, both of these collagens are actually available if you go through my Instagram at Jody's Fit Life. Jody's Fit Life. Three things you don't want to do mm -hmm. ruin collagen is smoking too much sunlight and eating too much sugar. That's it, I'm listening to it her. Ruins it. And she says it works, so I'm gonna keep on taking it. Jody, thank you so much for all being right. with us. Thanks, Tati. We will be right back, everyone. You drank it all! I finished I it. Yay! I finished it. Good